What is going on guys welcome back to another episode on the chaos craft fan server and we are back with another tour and we are in the warp woodbury again and as you can see there is alpha's house over there which we toured in the second or so episode and now we are touring his neighbor and <laughs> i think he's actually he is actually involved in building this one and this house is called la mansion and it was made by alpha x17 fallen asteroid and zingo the same combination who built hotel afx and now these three together built some crazy stuff it's going to be awesome touring this i can't wait it's actually some unique shapes and stuff on the outside which i want to show you and i'll go around it in a minute um leave a comment if you like it and let's see what people said nice place guys you're all good builders from carnage uh love the house peeps keep on building like this from aaron awesome say hi from me super angelica i like pie nice modern look and design from seth cool work Great job guys from Julia, very smexy, I like it from Nick, uh, love the house, love the design from GP, really like the interior, uh, the exterior of the house, good job from Captain JPG aka Victory because he got my recent shout out, and love it from Choco Warrior. Um, yeah, really nice comments and I really like the wall design on the outside with the cobblestone wall and sandstone underneath with the bush i think it's really good but some of the shapes and the materials used on this house guys are really crazy it's like it's like three materials mixed together on the outside it's, just, it's really hard no four materials because i've got half slabs as well it's really hard to mix together four materials and make them blend really well but that's what these guys have done it's really cool so let's go back around around to the front and let's go inside and tour this i don't think there's anywhere to go on the outside and those just like grass and stuff. Oh, Alpha make a YouTube channel. Sick build, Connor. It is a sick build, it really is. But let's go inside and check it out. Okay, cool. So we go in here, kind of like open plan. Not much in here. You just got like your uh, reception area of the house, and we've got a rug, and you've got string on the rug just to kind of add definition to the rug, which really looks good. Really like that. It's a really cool idea. Um, let what way should we go? Left or right? That looks like bedroom. So let's go over here. We've got a little seating area here, just a TV on the wall. Love the way they do these TVs on the signs. It looks really good. Kind of how modern TVs are with their bracket at the back, and you've got your seating area there. Um, don't think there's any more over this side. There's no basement or nothing. Is there? No. Um, let's go and check out the bedrooms. I should really shut doors behind me, shouldn't I? In here, nice simple bedroom with a big window at the front, which looks really good. You got a desk, a uh, simple bed there with a little unit over there with pictures, and a small little walk in closet here. Really nice bedroom. I'm thinking that the other two bedrooms might be the same if there is two. There's two gaps here. What's this? Oh, cool. Nice little bathroom with a shower, toilet, and a sink. Nice. So, what's in this side here? A uh, bedroom, similar bedroom to the one before, but you've got a TV on the wall. It's a smaller space, you've got a small bed there, a desk, and I'm guessing this is another closet. Yep, another closet. So what is around here? Now that leads to the back, I think. We'll go out there last. Shut that. So what's around here? Oh, look, got a balcony up there. Where are the, st oh, the stairs are over there? So what's around here? We've got a bar area. Let's go in here. Oh, nice little bar. You can serve all these type of drinks. You've got like a menu and serve all the people over here. Oh. That looks cool over there, kind of like a kitchen area, I think. Shut that. So we've got the stools going to the bar. Uh, that is the garage, I think. We'll go and look in there in a second. It's a kitchen area, got a table, got a kitchen counter. I really like this the use of like the item frames with the wall in it. Kind of looks like modern paintings kind of thing. So, uh, nice traditional kitchen area here. And let's go and check out the garage. Oh cool, nice double garage here. This one's closed. Have a nice sports car. You've got two nice sports cars. One, one white, one red. Lucky people. Uh, some parts at the back here where you where you keep your tools and stuff. And this garage door is open. It's really, really cool. Let's go back in over here. And let's make our way upstairs. Got a nice view there out to the back. We we'll go at the back last. Let's make our way upstairs and see what else is in this house. 
So we go up here, a uh, nice spiral-ish type of staircase. And we've got our balcony up here that looks over here too. Oh, cool! This is like a, just like a gaming area. I like this. I like the use of having the bedrooms downstairs, but then you have like upstairs just for kind of like entertainment. Uh, Professor Chaos's modern house. He did this similar thing like this, which is really cool. So we've got a pool table there, a nice little seating area with these big kind of loungy chairs with a table in the middle. Uh, bookshelves with a picture, and the just big loungy chairs here as well, where you can chill and a office and some bunk beds. This is cool. This is probably for the kids. This would be the best kids room ever. You come out here, you got your pool table and all this stuff. It's really good. Anything around here? Pro bathroom probably. Yeah, nice bathroom. And there's some blocks missing at the top. Just place them back. Nice, and you've got a good view out to the front. So let's go around the back and let's check out the backyard. Now you probably saw some of it from the flyby, and it isn't like your traditional backyard where people what's down here, nothing. Where people just usually put swimming pools. And I like the fact that they didn't use a swimming pool, so it kind of just like mixes it up a bit. So you've got a path going around here to this nice pond with this kind of like it's just uh, this crazy good terraforming with all these waterfalls pouring into the pond. I really like it. Got this kind of weird canopy thing over here. Not weird in a bad way, weird in a good way. Um, yeah, just really like this pond. Sometimes ponds just look better than a swimming pool because it's nice to just mix it up. You've got a little bench over there you can sit on. And I think this leads around into this little gazebo part around here where you can just sit down and chill and <laughs> watch the sunset. Oops, someone just turned it today. But yeah, I think that is everything. I think I've taught everything in this house. This house is crazy. La Mansion, really good, really nice modern build. Uh, seeing all these modern builds, guys, it's really getting me in the mood to do another modern build. Let's build. So keep an eye out for that. I'm probably going to do a modern build for my next Let's Build. Hopefully, I'm going to start working on that soon, and you guys will see that uploaded to my channel soon. But yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed this build. Let Alpha, Fallen, and Zingo know what you think about it in the comments. Um, um, you can come on this server whenever you want. The server's not whitelisted. The IP will be in the description. Um, it's got survival worlds, creative world, PvP worlds. So come and build on the server. You may get in the server Saturdays if you build some awesome stuff like we have seen right here. So yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you again in another video.